I like to start this video off by saying I really appreciate all of my haters. And I thank you for your beautiful private messages that you have been giving me. I feel so privileged. And I thank you because without you, there wouldn't be no me. So I like to give you a gift. And my gift to you is a big fat kiss my black ass. Thank you for liking and subscribing to my channel. Let's move on to the original video at hand. What I feel is a lot of brothers don't take time out to read up on the contributions of black women. I think if you did, you would look at black women in a whole different light. See, people fall by the lack of knowledge. And if you don't have knowledge, you'll believe anything. If you don't have knowledge, you'll believe anything the media tells you. Because you are being taught by the white media. So only education you get is from them. That's why you have to re-educate yourself. That's why you have to go in and you have to find out for yourself. Instead of taking and receiving any information that's given to you off the television or social media. It's called using your brain. Just to make it sound more simpler. Use your brain and understand what black women have done for us as a people. And if you do that, brother, I'm telling you, I woke up too. Because I didn't even know how much black women had contributed to the cause of us as a people. Until I read up on it and my whole perspective of black women changed. So I invite you to do the same thing. Now, we know that black women have held us down for years. Even in the times of anguish, in the 60s when we fought against the beast and all of those that were against us. Even in slavery, the black woman was by her man's side. Undisputed, without a fact, black women have held us down and have stood by our side through the whole thick and thin of the situation. They were there before any other woman wanted us. They was by our side when most of the women were walking by with their nose in the air saying, I'm not going to date him because society deems it as disrespectful. Remember that there was a time where all these women that was other than black wouldn't give you a time of day. So let's get to the original video at hand. And this is a question I'm going to ask my brothers. And I want you to be real because this is not a joke. This is a real question. Because, you know, first of all, you know I love my brothers. Let me tell you something. I love my brothers from the depths of my heart. There is no type of ill feelings against my brothers. I just want to educate them and open their eyes up. And that's the only reason why I make videos. And it's the only reason why I'm making this video today. Now, let's tell the truth, my brother. Will white women be by your side? If they started to jump out and whoop on you, would that white woman have stood by your side? Through all of slavery and everything that a black man went through, do you believe that docile white woman would have stood by your side? If they was beating you in the street, shooting you down, hanging you from trees, do you honestly think that nice, settled, docile woman would stand up and say, this is my black man, and I don't care what you do to him. I don't care how you beat him down. I'm going to stand by his side. Let's be real. Let's be real, my brother. Do you honestly think that white woman would stand by your side? But we all know the answer, don't we? You know and I know she would have not stood by your side. Through all the anguish that you went through and all the beatings and hangings and the stuff that we went through, you know dang well that weak, docile white woman would have not stood the test of time. You know it and I know it. So let's tell the damn truth. 
Let's be real with one another. It was the black woman that stood by our side. It was the black woman that stood up and said, I don't give a iota of how you feel about my black man. I'm going to love him and I'm going to stand by his side. It was the black woman that did that, brother. Okay? That's why you need to educate yourself. Instead of educating yourself on YouTube and the only thing you see is these black women, they put on um, YouTube with their booty shaking and all that stuff. And in your mind, you think that's all they have ever done. But you are so wrong. You need to go deep beyond the surface and you need to go read up on some of these great black women. And you need to go read up on what the black women really done for us. So I'm telling you, brother, and I'm telling you the truth. But this question I ask you, and I know it's a question you can't answer, but it's a question I would love for you to answer. Do you think that Dysal white woman would have stood by your side through getting beat up and dog sicked on you and everything that you've been through? If it start to happen right now, let's 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 take it to 2013 as we enter into 2014. If they started to jump out and do the things that they used to do to black men in the 50s and the 60s, if they jumped out right now in this current time and started to beat us down and started to hang us from trees and started to throw fireballs through the windows of our houses, do you honestly think, (laughs) I'm preaching today, do you honestly think that white woman would stand by your side? Do you think she was standing that burning house behind your, by your side? Excuse me. Be by your side no matter what happened. Do you honestly think that? Do you honestly think that she would stand by your side if they was to jump out and start beating you down and dragging you behind trucks again? Do you honestly? Let's be truthful with the situation here. But one thing I can tell you is that the black woman is the tried and the true. She has already passed her test and she's already proven that she is down for black men. She shouldn't have to prove to you that she is down for black men when she have already proven beyond the measure of understanding that she are down for her black man. She have already proven it. But the thing is, the white woman has not went through the fire. She has not proven beyond the reasonable doubt that she will stand by a black man's side through all the tortures and situations. So if I was you, I would go with the woman that have been tried in the true and has been through the fire and the one you know that's going to stand by your side. That's the one I will go with. I'm not going to say that all black women do this. I'm not going to say that they all will stand by your side, but the majority of them will. So that is my question to you. Do you honestly believe that that white docile woman would be by your side? When all the thunder and rain and hell was to fall out the sky right now. And it was to start doing to us what we we, we was going through back in the 50s and the 60s. Be honest with yourself, brother. Ask that question. Would she really be by your side? Would she? Like, subscribe. One love.